Yo, what is going on guys? Lost Sins here. Today doing some Master Duel has been, well, a while since I've uploaded, but anyway. <laughs> so today I was, I did a stream on this the other night, and I got really tilted against some, you know, one of them one turn uh, OTKs, one of them link summons, it was driving me crazy. I must have spent like seven minutes or something just waiting for this one dude to finish his turn. So <laughs> I ended up getting tilted. Uh, and I made a Buster Blader deck, probably one of my favorite cards from the Yu-Gi-Oh franchise that To be fair, I didn't realize they gave him such a good like upgrades that I've been out of Yu-Gi-Oh for a while And I've just kind of started to get back into it. So that's what this deck is. It's all me just messing around It's my first attempt on the deck. It needs a lot of work uh, But to be fair, I did love that one turn uh, Buster Blade was <laughs> a fusion. It went so well. I ended up messing like I made a few mistakes I'm still learning the deck still got to add and take cards out switch it around do I think it's perfect, but that is what it is. So we're actually doing a little, it was more like a little practice tool testing deck, see how it uh, did in theory. Like I said, it needs a lot more work. If I got a sh like a bad turn one hand, it would have been something else. But if you don't know, which most Yu-Gi-Oh players probably do know at this point, is that boss player gains uh, 1,000 attack for every dragon on the field. He inflicts piercing damage and any dragon in his line of sight just gets stuck into defense mode. It's such a cheesy strat like because you can combo with so many good cards and it's just ridiculous like i like it, keep in mind this was me just after making the deck glancing through what all the combos did i did spend a lot of this duel um i am actually using the replay from it because i did spend a lot of the duel just reading what the cards did uh you know first time using it my brain just could not remember all the different cards all the different effects everything it didn't go too well, I was having a bit of bad luck with some of the stuff. Um, this player here was, to be fair, if I weren't using this deck and just forced him into defense mode, he probably would have finished me instantly. But one main thing to keep out is this deck does specialize in just keeping everything a dragon. So you've got Buster Dragon, turns everything into a dragon. You've got DNA Surgery, which, <laughs> to be fair, in a bit we do draw at a clutch moment. So... Yeah, so like I said, I went into the deck, I want to do some tweaks on it. If you've got any other card recommendations, you think I should stick in it, just hit me up, let me know about it. Uh, like I said, I've just kind of gotten back into it, and I just thought, you know, I, I would like, there's a few decks I want to make, but I've just not been lucky with the packs, I haven't been getting the cards I want or need for the decks I want to make, so I thought, you know what, let's give the boys some love, good old Buster Blade or nah. Yeah, okay, this guy specializes against dragons, and you can sit there and do whatever you want, turn them to dragons. You might call it cheesy, but you know what, after like sitting there for like seven minutes, and just having people link summon non-stop, and then having a full field of fusion, like whatever, it, it's just annoying, bro. It is seriously annoying, I'm not even about that. So I literally, like I said, didn't know what the deck was, what I was doing with the deck. I'm just playing as I go, I'm having fun with it. And yeah, it just made for an interesting duel, so I ended up saving the replay, if I wanted to make a nice little video on it. Um, if you did see the live stream, which I know some of you that are subbed here are also follow me on Twitch, you probably would have seen just how tilted I ended up getting towards the end of my stream due to Link Summons. It was ridiculous. I just, man, I don't understand. But yeah, this is the turn where it looks a bit bleak for me. I'm thinking, oh no, this is what we're going to do. And your boy sits there and just has the digital heart of the cards as I draw... DNA surgery coming in clutch like I thought I thought this duel was done I was like nah I, I might just you know <laughs> this duel's done it's an L for me bro I should just go back and tweak the deck <laughs> DNA surgery comes out of nowhere saving the day and yeah man it, it was just so much fun it was ridiculous like I think to be fair, I just ended up ruining this whole guy's plan. He was just carry on playing how he would play normally, and I just there, like, sticking everything in defense mode. I love it. I'm probably definitely, definitely going to tweet this deck. Get it better. I'll probably do another video on it in the future. But, you know what? For now, this is just, like, a rough copy. I definitely need to tweak it, make it better. But I had a lot of fun with it. And to be fair, I love this, <laughs> this Buster Bladers effect. It's so good, but it's so it feels so cheap. But at this point, I don't care. I'm so sick and tired of what OTKs, and <laughs> I'm fed up of them. Like, I'm about ready to just start making some cheese decks and just having the time of my life with it. You don't even understand, bro. <laughs> you really don't. I mean, 
you know, you probably know if you play the game, you're sitting there on turn, like, wait for your turn, you don't even get a turn, draw a card, and my man's already got Exodia. So, you know what? <laughs> it is what it is. But yeah, like I said, I'm going to tweet the deck. In the future, I'll probably come out with another one with a more transition deck. But guys, if you if you did enjoy, drop a comment, drop a like, all that good stuff. We're going to end up sitting here, probably doing some more streams in the future, so if you want, come check me out on Twitch. And as we draw another TNA surgery, just make a thing. My guy surrendered in the end. It is what it is. I was like, you know what, I'll take my dub. But yeah, if you did enjoy, drop a like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. We'll see you on the next one.